Hey, what's going on guys, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Last episode, we were just hanging out with Cassandra, and now we're about to continue our story on the Isle of Skye. So let's see what we can do here. Let's go over to quests. All right, I just fast traveled over to the settlement. I don't know where that is now. I just fast traveled to it. It's behind us apparently, this is it. Very small settlement. We got ourselves an opal. Oh, someone to talk to out here. Oh, this is that lady. There we go. Eivor, are you looking to return to your settlement? Ah, yes I am. Let's return yes. to England. Let's depart. Alright, we're back into Ravensthorpe now. And let's see what else we can do here. We should probably go up and see if we have another alliance we can make. Where are we going? We gotta go up here uh, to Ranvi. Let's see if she's alright. Ranvi, are you well? You seem distant. I'm fine. Only a little tired, but well enough. Shall we look at the map? Not until you tell me what is wrong. Oh, I think I have. I feel somewhat trapped. In this room, in this settlement, in this life. I cannot help you with your life just now, but... I can get you out of this room. What do you say? I don't know. There is much work to be done. Stop. It's time to go outside for a little bit. Just Touch grass. Hours. Come on. We could take a ride to Grand Bridge or somewhere nearby for a change of pace. That sounds lovely. And too far to consider just now. But thank you, Eivor. Maybe another time. Now, what was it you needed? All right, Ramvi. Let's Ranvi, go. To, let's go. Take, a, take break. a break. Let us make for Grandbridgeshire and get you out of this musty room. Do you mean now? Right now? Correct. Oh, you said you were tired of all this. So why not stretch your legs and fill your lungs? I did ask, didn't I? You're right. Lead the way, Eivor. All right. Sounds good, Ramvi. Let's get out of Follow here. Me. You need a break. Let's grab our trusty steed. We'll take the long ship today. This trip is for us. Just you and me. Is that a problem? Not at all. So long as I get some air and sun, I will be fine. I spend too much of my day in the longhouse. We will need to cross the river at some point if we want to enter Granterbridgeshire. If you know a better way, I would love to hear it. Is swimming not an option? Swimming? I don't know. Uh, are you joking? A boat or a horse would always do, but I'm not opposed to the more traditional methods. We're not going on a date with his brother's wife. Right? It's kind of weird. We're gonna have to try and make it up this hill. I are making it up just fine. Gotta let the horse breathe, though. Got some minerals over there. Let's get those out a different time. Yeah, there's no bridge over here. I hope she likes swimming. It really is lovely here. Being this far east of the settlement, this water smells off. You get used to it. I do not wish to. It really is. It really is lovely here. <laughs> How many Isn't times is she gonna say that? Isn't that awful? You think safety awful? To live one's life in so small a pen, and hear stories from you and the scouts without ever venturing further. Gods, do you smell that? The earth and the air. It is good to be out here. Oh my brother! Die! Yeah, you missed. Oh, these guys can be enemies too. Yep. There's a fox. Eivor, there. What is that? This is where the summer army retreated when Grantobridge was lost. They seem to have resettled the city in full now. Right, right. I know this land so well by its map, but to see it in person brings it to stunning life. A Roman marvel. I will not soon forget this sight. Yeah, you gotta get out more, Ramby. You gotta do it. And here we are. Welcome to Granterbridge. We should make our way to the Longhouse. Ah, oh, it's bigger than I imagined. Rustic, woody, beautiful. And everything seems quite new. Under Soma's guidance, the Summer Army built this town up from a small village. They wanted a hub for trade near London, and a launching point for incursions into Wessex. Well, it is impressive. Some interesting architectural ideas here too. All right, let's get off the horse. Time to go inside, Randy. Well, it's been quite a while since I've seen your face around here. That's well, true. I know it's been quite a while. I think one of Soma's loyal men, Magni, is it? Yeah. Good memory. Good to see you, you again. This is Randy. A dear friend and a sturdy fighter. Well met, Randy. Eivor seems to have a preference for befriending lovely women. You know, I noticed the same thing. I expected more <laughs> people about Magni. Something happened. Soma rounded up some warriors and took them west. She's hoping to open a new trade route with Ox and Avoda. Only now, in times of trouble, I have discovered I am not the surrogate leader I should hope to be. What sort of trouble? Oh, a pack of surly bandits have been camped nearby. To the east of the water's edge. They attack all merchants who travel here by river or road, and word is spreading quickly. 
It's keeping traders at bay. That could cripple your town if it carries on too long. <laughs> it's crippled me already. The bastard stole my horse yesterday morning. Yeah, no more horse. So what will we you... We can take care of them, Magni. And if we don't find your horse, we will steal you a new one. Well, that would ease my mind. I have nothing to offer you for this deed, but the bandit surely would. Take from them what you like. Good. Perfect. Sounds Consider good. Consider the matter handled. Eivor, come. We have a camp to raid. Man, she's been itching to get out. Okay. Time to eliminate the bandits. The bandits are camped on the river, he said. East of the water's edge. You volunteered us for a fight, Radri. Is that your idea of a pleasant ride through the country? It must be. I surprised even myself. Away from the table for a day and already you are lusting for blood. A feeling you must know well, no? I have always wanted to experience the world as you do. And now I will. Unless you have a more interesting day planned for us. We will help Magni and clear these bandits. But do not be rash when we fight them. The Raven Clan needs your steady hand. Yes, indeed, my lord. I shall follow your order to the letter. <laughs> if I did not know any better, I That's would say you're teasing me. Oh, certainly not, Eivor Wolf kissed Iron Fisted Drenger. I would never tease one with such commanding authority. There, the bandit camp. All right, stay close. Oh, she do is flirting. Rude and looks what about our brother, though? Is this what the uh, conflict's gonna be? Nicely done. I thought you wanted to do this in secret. You seemed hot for a bat. So here we go. Oh, that was a big hit. Oh, it did dead, though. We need more rations. Was that a thing of apples? Didn't get anything from that, though. That. Got a compass from it. Wasn't even food. Can't read that right now. Uh, let's just take this guy out real quick. Here we go. It is. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. He's dead now. Ooh. All right. Let's go read that note real quick. Uh, there's another one. And then we can read the note. Oh my goodness, we totally destroyed that guy. Now to deliver Magni his horse. There's some ration. I feel stronger already. Oh, that was actually adrenaline. Okay. Then it's journal. Another night, another good haul with the lads. The time we ambushed a couple of Mer Mercian soldiers from Lettishire. Brigrid's boys. They're well equipped, those buggers. Took what coin they had on them, their swords, helms, even got myself a new pair of trousers because they didn't fit the henbold. I think I'm starting to fancy this spot. Looks of fresh meat coming through Cranton Bridge. Oh boy. Well, time to head back. Well, she wanna be on my horse? She decided to get her own. Oh no, it's his horse. The horse for him. That's what he asked that for. That was a thrill, Eivor. We are champions of Grand Bridge. Do you know of any other towns that need liberating? You don't think we have had enough drama for one day? We should return to the city. I don't know if she knows where she's going right now. Let's get some of these berries here. Ooh, some of those arrows too. You don't think we have had enough drama for one day? We should return to the settlement. Or we We're could here. have a drink to celebrate our victory. At home. Tekla has all the mead and ale we could want. Eivor, our outing has hardly begun. Find us an alehouse and let us make ourselves at home. Let's return the horse. And if your thirst remains, we'll look around. Yeah, she's... She seems interested. Magni, That's the weirdest part. We solved your bandit problem. Did you? Well done! And did you find my sweet mare? Sure your did. Your horse is outside, waiting for you. Thank the gods she is safe. And thank you, Avo. And your friend Randy, wherever she is. She is here somewhere. Probably going to get drinks. Oh yeah, what she's are ready you to drink. Playing at? A drinking contest. You versus me. Wolf kissed versus table maiden. Ranvi, we can do better than table maiden. Mead queen then. All right. All right. Let's drink. Let's drink. Beautiful. It's time I win the biggest win. This is gonna be easy. We got this. This is so easy so far. Alright, last one. Here we go, guys. Ooh. 
Well, who we got it? We beat her. There, you see? Should not have tried to outdrink me, Randri. It cannot be done. Strange. I see your lips moving so rapidly, yet all I hear is, thank you, Randvi. So? so, are you satisfied? My head is ringing like a bell. More than satisfied. Now come, we'll ride this off and take in the air as we head home. After just one more stop. Randvi. It's a sunken tower near a waterfall, close to home. We can stop for a look and then you are free of me. It's near the highest point of a hill, just south of the settlement. Mm. Easy to spot, I'm sure. All right, one last stop then. I know it might not show, Eivor, but I am terribly excited. Oh, it shows. But why? Sounds up. Something has to be up. I might have to, Magni. Thank you for everything. No, no, thank you. Safe travels. All right, he's making moves on her, though. I think you may have punctured poor Magni's heart back there. What can yeah, I for say? real. <laughs> not the first, and it will not be the last. I name you Randvi, slayer of bandits, breaker of hearts. I will sound it with pride. Sunivar described this tower for me. A desolate yet peaceful place. I am eager to see it. After a full day of action, finally you wish to calm down. I've had my fill of adventure. Time for a little rest. Alright, so maybe she's not trying to flirt with us. Maybe she's just a little... I was uh, wondering something. Flirtatious? You and Soma. Was there something more to your bond? You spoke of her with a particular shine in your eyes. We grew very close, very quickly. Is that what you mean? Mm. No, I mean... Did something happen between you two? What sort of question is that? An innocent one. Innocent as a newborn babe. Nothing happened between us. That is my answer. Hmm. I find that disappointing. If I were you, I might have tested the waters. Eivor, entangled by a hardy Jarlskuna as she leads her army to victory and prosperity. A rather appealing match. I'm going to pretend your last words were taken by the wind. Look there. That must be the tower. Take the bridge. All right. We are finally here. Renvi? Just as beautiful as Suniva's stories. Can you imagine how it looked when it was first built? Hundreds of winters ago. Sometimes when looking at a map, oh, I imagine little, little people close. in their little armies traversing the land. And now, staring at these ruins, I imagine people of old, how they lived, never knowing what would become of their monuments. You have a fertile imagination. I want a view from the top. Shall we? Lead on. Sounds good. Here we go. Just like I'm Keep better up. at drinking. Mind oh, no. Put your fingers. I'm way up here already, Rambi. You cannot beat me at climbing. There's something there. A squirrel, looks like. She's still down there trying to get up here. Come on, Rambi. Does she want to just stay down on that platform? Like, she does. All right. We got to jump down. There we go. You're going to say something about Sigurd. I know you a are. stunning view. It reminds me of my early years in Norway. How I used to climb the hills beyond the wood. You have an adventurous heart. I hardly see it behind the table, but... Now I've watched you scale a tower in furs, soaking wet. I was rowdy in my youth. Hunting. Sailing. I was a wildling of the open air, before I became this staunch and stoic woman. Married wow. off in service of peace between two clans. A noble and worthy role, but not one I had ever imagined for myself. You would have made a fine wandering warrior. A Yom's Vikinger. Free to come and go as she pleased. I think so too. It may be we would have sailed together over the open seas, raiding or traveling. Mm. Or faced each other on the field of battle. Without your marriage to Sigurd to secure peace, our clans might still be at war. True. Very true. Thank you for today. Every bit of it has been a dream and... and I'm not keen to wake. Then don't. We can stay here as long as you like. Yes. What? what I knew that? that was gonna happen. Oh no, I am... I'm sorry. I shouldn't have. I got away from myself. I knew she was gonna do that. No need to apologize. I Sigurd called that. Sigurd is your that. brother and I... I have put you in a very difficult position. The heart does not do politics like the head. It may be the meat. It may be the air. But there's no need to apologize. I am sober enough. But the truth of it mm. is... This could I also be a trap. I have for some time now. I care for you, Eivor. Oh, you know what? Secret doesn't really care for her, does she? Let's just make it interesting. I guess, no, maybe it was it was arranged. Uh, or it wasn't arranged. It was to get the clans 
safe, so like friendly. So basically, her father just sold her to the other clan, I guess. So let's do this. Comforting to hear. I have long felt the same way, but I banished the thought that this would ever happen. Many times I wished to tell you, wished to say what was in my heart and what I desired, but duty kept me from it. Say all you like. Today has meant so much. We rode, we fought, we drank, we laughed. You showed me your world. Not in words, but deeds. Deeds are more direct than words. This isn't going on YouTube, is it? Wonder what else they did. I'm just kidding. I do not. Low FPS birds. Oh, she's gone. Andre? Something wrong has happened, mm. I'm telling you right now. Must have returned to the settlement. It was all a ploy. Because now something has become between me and Seagard. I don't know though. Because he didn't really care for her, did he? I have no idea. I'll turn it back. Let's go back to the settlement. All right, let's go see what. Yes, yes, one more. And Actually, you know what? Let's see what's inside this market here. We haven't even looked at this yet. Good day, good day. Good day, sir. Let me see the shop. What do you have today? Ooh, that's kind of cool looking. What is that? Like a thing for the settlement? Make it look cool. A two. A weeping willow. This settlement. This should liven up the view from everything we sell has been time tested, rather approved. Thank there we go. And I have to go. I'm off. Good. Yes, yes. One more. Let's add no this willow somewhere. I know we can put now, it one, where that Odin statue is. Where else can we put a decoration? A desert oasis. Far away. A place of mystery. Wonder. Can we replace that? Oh, we can't. Oh, this is literally where we do it. Oh, no, it's not. What is this? Oh, that's nice. I like that. All right, so we'll see what Rampy's doing now. See if she even mentions what just happened. She'll probably say, it was a mistake. Good day, my love. Oh, uh, never mind. Well, that's... Uh, oh, there's a note over here. Rampy's to-dos. Rowan wants more salt for the horses. Tecla says, hold her too loud in the morning. Speak to Petra, but... Get her question when I always teach children salt. Okay, so she's keeping tabs on everybody. It is becoming increasingly difficult to look across the alliance table at Eivor and not think of what could be. I tell myself it's only Sigurd's absence, but the lag grows thinner, weaker by the day. Oh yeah, she's been feeling this for a while. I didn't realize that. I wish to thank you and Eivor and the rest of the settlement for the great kindness you have shown me and the things you've all taught me. Thought I may have felt a nonsense at times the days I spent with all of you were joyous and educational. Though I go now to do the work that I am meant for. I know that I'll return for this place and its people one day and I look forward to that. Take care until we meet again. Over. Okay, so he's gone now. Speak to Ramby. Track quest. It won't let me speak to her, which is kind of weird. Oh, now I can. you left so suddenly. There is work to be done. There always is. I see. But do not think for a moment that I have forgotten you and our wonderful day. Uh, nor would I wish you to. Good. Then we see eye to eye. And heart to heart. Yes, indeed. Until our next moment alone, mm. we should return to our great work. England will not pacify itself on our behalf. No, indeed. Back to work then. Okay, show the alliance map. Alliance map. <laughs> Seen some of those options? Oxen Forshire. Let's do that. Sigurd told me he had business there. Ah, yes. Sigurd is there now, in fact. He bids you go meet him as soon as you can. He has partnered with a rebellious thane called Giedrich and hopes to install Giedrich as Elderman in exchange for an oath. There is an alehouse at the center of Buckingham. Sigurd will meet you there. Sounds good. Let's go there. And if Sigurd asks about what just happened, you're gonna have to pull. Where is Buckingham? Gonna, I mean, you're gonna have to tell him. <laughs> Along the Great Owls River that divides Oxenefordshire, Sigurd will be pleased to see you. Ooh, yeah, he might not be. Depending on how he actually truly feels about you, he might not be happy. But I'll tell you what, this just got a whole lot more interesting because of this. This one begins a long time ago at a desert oasis. Actually, can I fast travel there? Nope. No, I can't. I know fast travel points. Let's go to a ship. What's going on, crew? Hey, boy. What does you think? It's time we go. Let's go. We must row in these waters. Strike up a tune. Nope. Sail. 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 Catch the wind. Here we go. There we go. Go into the quest objective. Uh, sir, you might want to move your boat. We're just going to run him over. Here we go. It did not even really do anything to that guy. Sing us a song. I definitely need more rations when we end up where we're supposed to be going. At the alehouse. Bring the mast yeah, yeah, yeah. down. Underneath the bridge. And time to put the mast back up. Raise the mast. Run up. Monkey sailing here, Avon. 
Let's just make sure we're going the right way. Yes, we are. Oh, we're gonna hit the, yep, we're gonna hit the side. Oh, let's just get back onto the river, guys. Let the sail out. Sail it. Let's have a song. Sail out. No, we don't need a story. What is happening? I think the boat's stuck. Well, that was fun, boys. Good luck on your own. Actually, I'm gonna cross the river here first. Not the horse. Oh, <laughs> just ran right in the river. There we go. Make our way on over to Sigurd in the in the ale house. And we gotta come clean if you ask us. Whereabouts are we going? Oh, I see, I see. How can he sense that they're on alert? Ooh, that was close. Oh, he spotted us. Ah, who's this one? Must be anonymous. Soldiers are tightly wound. There we go. We'll just hide for a little bit. Don't come over here. You're gonna end up dying. Don't come over here. Perfect. All right, we're here. Wait! Stop! Alan, what's Alan, Eivor? We could have caught you to bloody giblets, Wolkist. Why so didn't. unnerved, brother? It's not like you. Half the soldiers of the Shire are hunting us. You must have noticed. Is and why, that why is that? you haven't come home? You're playing hide and fetch with the Mercian soldiers. Your brother's a busy man, Eivor. Weighed down by pressing duties. It's good to see you again, Basim. Even if you haven't kept my brother trained on the task at hand. It's not my place to lead your brother about like a bridled mare. Now there's an idea, <laughs> brother. We should be forging alliances. Send this man back to his warren before he leads you astray. Eivor. Gods above, I'm grateful you've joined us. We have made strides towards an alliance, in fact. A local thane called Gidritz has pledged an oath to me. I've heard of him. The alewife also mentioned a Lady Edwin who commands the soldiers. Why not ally with her? Lady Edwin's husband was the Shire's elderman, until Gudrun's army ended his life. Now she's taking up her husband's fight, with a promise of aid from King Alfred of Wessex. Edwin vows revenge on the Danes who stole her husband and her livelihood. From what we know, Alfred is a fearsome king. If Edwin can win his full support, this shire is lost to Wessex. So to fight her, you've pledged your sword to a minor thane who likely commands a gang of farmers and fishermen. With pitchforks. Have faith, Eivor. A few hundred Saxons armed forks. with hayforks and billhooks can be terrified. Gods. All men and women, noble or peasant, have within them the seeds of something greater. This is true. Sometimes greater than the average mind can fathom. Well, Edwin has Giedrich in shackles now. All your plotting has turned to ash. Not if we act soon. She dragged her prisoners to the Longhouse. With you here, we can mount the surprise strike. If Giedrich is our best chance for an alliance... Could he smell Randy on my breath? Maybe. The Paladin Stone. Sigurd, has Basim talked you into something of little reward? Eivor, have you lost hope in my warcraft? I heed Basim's wisdom, but he follows my lead, always. He has the look of one who trusts none but himself. Basim is secretive by nature, but he is wise and forthright, and he has opened my eyes to a magnificent truth. He has promised me a reward so unusual, so incredible, it will shatter your mind to shards. Well, I'm Brother, interested in seeing what that is. has the iron heft of a war axe. Do not let Basim and his prophecies of good fortune sway you from our simple goal. Never. Our goal is fixed. We shall soon be the lords of Mercia, then all of England. But Basim has a deep insight. He's read wisdom in the lines of my face and heard the litany of my forefathers and... Well, there will be time enough for my saga later. And we will continue this story in the next episode of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, and let me know what you guys think of Abor and Ramvi in the comments down below. Thank you guys.